Hello, hello, and welcome back to To The Moon. Um, I hope you guys are having fun with the series. I, I always enjoy playing this game, even though it's my second time playing the game. Uh, it's very heartfelt and sentimental. The character development is very well done. Um, I don't know. Okay, I have two. I have two things right now. I don't know if there's anything else I can do. Maybe I have to go up to uh, Johnny and see. If there is a memento there, uh, or if I can go down. I wish they can run faster. Like, oh, oh, oh. Save just in case. I really enjoy the music, um, as I've mentioned many times before. Uh, can I go down? No. I, I, I really like talking during the games, like, uh, you know, during this time where I'm trying to find the pieces of the puzzle to get to the next level, but uh, I feel like this game, it's that kind of game where if I try to crack any jokes, it's just I don't know, it just kind of ruins the feel of it, so I do apologize if I am being kind of quiet. I just kind of... Uh, the immersion of the game, it's... It's, uh, it's best whenever you are completely focused on it, as opposed to trying to um, kind of start other topics and talk about other stuff. But So I, I will be mostly quiet during this game unless I'm reading the dialogues, unless there's something to comment about what what is being done or said during the game. So let's see, we're gonna go to Johnny. Oh! Oh, okay. They gave us two already. Uh, I assume there's nothing there so we can go back down and go to the next area. And I still haven't figured out how to get rid of the cursor. I have been playing this all in succession. Uh, so I might even just finish this game all in one day because it's not a very long game. <laughs> right. Got it in three moves! Holla holla! Pickled olives, because those are the green ones, right? I think I've had them. They're pretty good. So you guys are really going for it, huh? Yep, the construction is starting in just a few months. It's a bit of a squeeze, we had to split the payment. But with financing, we'll make do. How wonderful, having your dream house built in such a beautiful site. You had your wedding at that lighthouse near there all those years ago, didn't you? That's not all that special about it. We have a long history with that place. Well, wow, it's good to have some good news at a get-together for once. Cheers and congratulations, you two! Hey, cheers. Be right back. I'm gonna get some fresh air. Me too. She just walked on top of Johnny. Well, buddy, it's sure been a while. Hasn't it? Who knew how hard it is to get across a few cities nowadays? That river, still so quiet, huh? Eh, she's actually been talkative at home, and with Isabel. I guess she's just not used to you. Haha, <laughs> so I'm, about th I'm the bad guy here, huh? Oh hey, did you tell River that thing from back then? I did. So, how did she take it? For the most part, she took it well. But something bugs me. Ever since the incident, she's been making these strange rabbits out of paper. Origami rabbits? Yes, lots of them. Haha, <laughs> I used to fold origami animals for my daughter all the time. What's wrong with that? I don't think it's the same thing. She's been doing nothing but making the same rabbits day in and day out. Our house is literally filled with them right now. Didn't Isabel say something like that is a common trait with River's condition? Yes, but, with some but something doesn't feel right this time. When I asked her about it, she never answers. Instead, she just gets this distant look in her eyes, as this it's almost as if she wants something from me. And the strange thing is, I feel like there's something I owe her too. Have you asked Isabel? Yes, she says she talked to her about it, but got nothing. 
Well, I'm certainly not one to inquire, but I'll tell you this. I've known you since middle school, and you're notorious for overthinking. You're probably just imagining things. There's no need to get too worked up. Usually when someone says that, there's always something wrong. But I'll give you the benefit of the doubt. You're probably right. Probably? I'm always right, John. Eh... Wait, so even he himself never knew what was up with those rabbits? Forget about the stupid rabbits, we've got bigger problems. It's a confined memory and there are no mementos anywhere. Don't worry, we can probably draw one out of him. Ow. Leave it to me, I just gotta give the bartender a quick visit first. Booze while working. Booze, 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 booze. Hey there, could I get anything for you? Hey out, could I get a bottle of pickled olives please? Sure. Cash or credit? Check! Err, uh, I'm sorry, we don't take checks. Oh. Just put it on my tab then. Wait, does that mean you don't have any money? You're so getting resetted. Hey there, could I get anything for you? I hello, I would. Could I get a bottle of pickled olives, please? Sure. Cash or credit? Just put it on my tab. I feel like spending big today. Oh, thank you, sir. Here are your pickled olives. Thanks, bro. You'll be getting an enormous amount of tips today. Thank you, sir. You're such an ass, Neil. Oh, they said not. Alright, that's one memory. I'm gonna give the pickled olives to John. Hopefully we'll get something out. Why? Is that a ball of pickled olives you're sporting? Yeah. Are you a fellow olive lover? Indeed I am. Just got a fresh bottle of them myself, in fact. Mind if I join you? Oh, sure. Why don't you grab a seat? We'll down a whole bottle together. Oh, yeah, that sounds just swell. I have a disabled stasis simulation now. Oh, Neil, I don't think I feel like it. I am so going to get you back for this. <laughs> <laughs> so that's how we got our first toaster. Oh, ho, ho, ho. You okay there? Yes, I'm just savoring the amazingness of pickled olives. They're wonderful, aren't they? Yeah, I just can't understand how anyone could ugh, find such things to be disgusting. Take your time, we've got two bottles left. <laughs> so I said, hey, that's not right. And they totally agreed. <laughs> and you know what else is wrong with society today? I don't know what. Yeah, I actually have it right here. Why? May I see it? Eh, okay. What? Here it is. And freeze! Finally! Dear lord! How are the olives, Neil? Oh, shut your mouth. I'm guessing that's the uh, loop thingy. Memento. Wait. Don't you dare. Don't worry. Sheesh. See? I'm doing it by the books. Hulk smash! Neil, seriously. I'm trying to get into this and you're ruining the mood. Totally worth it. <laughs> uh, I am assuming this is the photo. I can't tell which ones are the ones that I can click on. I think it's these. Got it in a four! Ah, oh, crap, did I mess up? Oh, I clicked too fast and it screwed me over! No. That sucks. Where'd they go? Oh wait, they're frozen. Never mind. What? Oh, what's the note? Ah, they're in their younger days. They don't have gray hair anymore. Oh, the lighthouse is boarded up. I, don't, I think I just noticed that. Was it boarded up earlier? I don't think so. I think it was fully working lighthouse. Whoa. Crikey nutcrackers! You aren't Australian. Who cares? We're like 20 billion nanometers off the ground and standing on a damn flagpole. Just jump down. It's not like you can get hurt here. You kidding me? It's a freaking skydive. You can't stay on here. You can't get off. God, I hate it when this stuff happens. I swear, this place... Ava, what the bleep? Bliss. <laughs> 
I don't, I don't think I would do that even if I couldn't get hurt. Like in a simulation thing, holy crap. I don't like heights. I went rock climbing a couple of days ago, or like a month or two ago, or like three months ago, I don't know. And I could go up, but I could not go down. <laughs> well, why would they embed her like this? I suppose she's just no longer needed. No longer needed? By ships, I mean. I know how it is, now that everything has GPS and all that. Look, River. This place means a lot to me too, and I've been thinking. In our current state, things have been pretty stable. If we save well in a few years, we could afford to build a house on top of here. It's going to be a squeeze when I'm sure we'd be able to see it from the window. In the morning, at night, we'd always be nearby. And and we could walk here anytime. She'll never be alone again, John. I'll be able to watch her, watch over her every day. Yeah, we will. What? Good for them. You gotta be kidding me. You remember what happens, don't you? It's like watching a train wreck. The ending isn't any more important than any of the moments leading to it. The important thing is that over here, they are happy. Let's move on. Are they a memory? No, they're just, you know, hugging there forever. Wait a minute. They were referring to the lighthouse as Anya, weren't they? I suppose so. Then that river, she declined treatment for the sake of a lighthouse? Isn't that a bit too extreme? I've seen stranger things in the course of the job. Me too, but ugh. I can never wrap my head around it. It's none of our business anyway. She is not our client. Received note, Anya. I want to save. Save. Note, Anya. Abandoned lighthouse by the cliffside. Alright, so I'm not sure what else can be the momento. I assume that we just keep walking down or something. Oh, 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 oh. Hello? Uh, alright. So we're going backwards in time. I guess we're going further, traveling further down. Um, there's one, two. Alright, I gotta find the, the place that will help us. Oh, oh, rabbit. Prepare. Alright, so five is the ideal. Yatta! I did it! Five. The yellow bunny. Oh. River? So quiet. Donde esta? Alright, um, alright. A yellow paper rabbit. Dear lord, not again. Uh, anything else around here? I assume not. The silence is kinda... Ugh. Oh no 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 no! Go down. Old baby grand piano. How the heck did they move this thing upstairs? Who knows? But I bet it'd be a piece of cake for the TARDIS. Not really. You can't even get it through its door. Hmm, true. Well, that settles it. Moving pianos is a pain in the arse for everybody. It'd probably take an entire episode to get it inside. Doctor Who reference? I wouldn't mind seeing such an episode. Me neither. It sounds pretty epic. There's something here. I have never seen Doctor Who, but the TARDIS is that the the phone booth, I believe. Boxes of plain paper. Uh oh, I think I know where this is going. I don't get a memento for that. Ugh. Two, three. You went out for a haircut early this early in the morning. What 
What are you making there? Rabbits. Did you see the rabbit I left for you? Yeah. Tell me about that rabbit. Huh? Describe the rabbit. Um, it was yellow. What else? A bit puffy. And? Well, it's just a paper rabbit. I don't know what else to describe it. You're acting strange, River. Is something wrong? River? I don't know about you, but I'm getting some inverse deja vu. I think I know of her condition, but this is rather odd even for that. You think she's... Do you? Perhaps, who knows? I don't remember. But like you said, she's not a client. Let's just get what we're paid for over with. Uh, uh, many long strands of orange hair. Platypus! No, oh, that's the memento. I'm guessing the rabbit. So this is the day she started it, huh? Alright, thank you guys so much for watching To The Moon. I hope you are enjoying this series so far, just as I have. I don't remember a lot about it, so um, uh, much of it is going to be like a huge surprise and just uh, remembering everything for me. But um, uh, we will be continuing this shortly, and I will see you in the next episode. Bye!